Hi guys, my name's Mitz and I am going into my WordPress dashboard to show you how to add a add media button for your contributors. Okay, so we're going to go into the dashboard of my website. Now this is a theme installed on here. So I need to go to the theme editor which is you go under appearance and then go to editor okay so now I want to go to the custom or functions file which is theme functions so it's functions.php so I'm going to press on that and in here um, I've already got my code is on my notepad I'll just make it a bit smaller uh, there it is there and I've copied it okay now the reason um, everyone's got this on their website and everything and um, sometimes when you copy code it gets um, other characters in the background it depends where you copy it from so I like to copy it uh, paste it onto a notepad which cleans it out and makes it pure code or just pure text okay so it's not going to corrupt anything so then we go to the functions.php in your theme now I'm just going to go down the bottom and um, I'm looking for a space where so just say we've got this here um, I don't know what your theme looks like or anything but I'm just looking for an end of something and then somewhere where I can paste something so this looks like that's the end of something there and now I'm just gonna press the control and V and this is what I've just pasted in here okay now what it's saying is to allow contributor uploads okay um, uh, it's adding an action alright now that's all it's doing the rest of the contributor um, you know um, allowances are going to be the same the only thing that's going to change is that they can upload an image right so now I'm just going to go down the bottom here and press on update file now if you're not experienced in editing um, your code of your website uh, before you do anything I would like you to copy every little bit of text in this file and um, paste it into a notepad and save it there for a minute okay so if you make a mistake you can always paste your code back in here now also one little mistake here if you take that out you can wreck um, your website okay so just don't go touching anything don't accidentally delete a little comma or anything like that okay so now that we have saved that I'm going to um, show you another website and I've already signed in into let's build websites as a guest poster okay then I went to put add new post and it has the add media button there now I did exactly the same thing um, it's got everything else that it had before now the other thing is if you go into the post sections so just remember I'm assigned in as a guest now as you can see I can't edit an already posted um, uh, post okay it's already published so I can't touch it so that's because I'm a contributor so yes um, I can add an image I can put a new post um, I can submit it for review but I cannot go back and edit a post after it's been published all right so that's good um, I'm going to show you another way to put it in a thesis website now so I'll just go over to a thesis website okay so now I'm in a thesis website okay so this is a little bit different so I'm going to go to the thesis here and then I'm going to go to custom file editor and that's the CSS but I want the custom functions PHP 
and then I'm going to press on edit selected file so like I said before you need to be very careful here of what you touch okay so I'll show you that I have already pasted the code in here now what I did is I found a gap again so when you see something like that then it shows um, that that whatever's up there is finished so what I did is paste it in here there it is if blah 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 right down to that bracket there okay so there it is again add the action to allow the contributor uploads okay and then I press down the bottom here it's got the big ass save button down the bottom now what I'm gonna do is log out from under my name okay and I'm gonna log in as the guest poster yep okay I'm in so now I've got a limited menu I'll go into the post section okay so I'm in the post section and as you can see this one isn't posted yet it's scheduled and these have been done so I can only view them I can't edit them so what I'm going to do is press on add new post bit slow today and this is what I'm looking for right here this add media button it's as simple as that that's it all I did was paste that code into the custom functions file and now thesis has an add media button for a contributor all right that's it thanks for watching